Minister, um, there's a huge crisis in South Tipperary General Hospital, indeed, to you hate to call now, um, for Army St. Joseph's. Well, 70 nursing posts, crucial nursing posts, haven't been filled due to the embargo. Now, these nursing posts are funded, and it's because of retirements or maternity leave, the like of that, and the embargo is blocking the safe recruitment. The safe working practices are being eroded, according to the um, INMO and others, and we need these posts. It's not a matter of the funding. They are posts already, but people have left, retired, are indeed, and, and, and sick pay or maternity leave, and they need to be full, uh, filled immediately because safe working practices have been eroded according to the, to the hospital's own guidelines and uh, the nurses' own guidelines. So we need these posts filled immediately. And no talk, there's no embargo at all recruited. This is real time. These statements are made by the INMO yesterday. 70 positions, nurses not filled. With regard to the health budget earlier on, where we, we've 3,000 additional staff being recruited, being, re, being recruited this year. Okay, so the, oh no, I understand. The, 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 the point that you've raised, I'll raise directly with Minister Donnelly. I think everyone understands it, it, as well that to fill any posts across the country in any sector, it can take some time now because we have full employment effectively in, in this country. But what I will do, Deputy McGrath, is I will bring that matter directly up with Minister Donnelly and I will ask him to respond directly to you. Thank you, Minister. Because you've raised an important point here as well. We want to ensure that staff safety uh, and patient safety is paramount as well. So I will raise it with Minister Donnelly. Deputy McNamara. 